everybody i'm your host brian watkins and welcome to the another edition of the brian watkins channel my subject today is me feeding the birds this is uh something i do when i'm relaxing and going over what new videos i'm going to make for my viewers um it's pretty interesting on how birds let you know that they're hungry usually um they're come up on me really close and that's how I can usually tell that they're hungry so usually if I you know got some extra stuff for them I usually put it out now what I was trying to do I was trying to fend for you all uh, oh well the reason why I'm making this video is for all of the other viewers that may be uh, bird feeders too I'm not really sure I'm sure I'm not the only one because I've seen plenty out here where I'm at so uh, let's get started um, I don't know birds are really smart because before I turned on the camera it was a gang of them they was all right here and um, they, I guess the camera shy or no I'm filming them on camera or something oh wait a minute there go one over there oh and there go another one right there oh here they go oh. now you see them see how they slowly coming to get the food yeah, see right there they are so intelligent because a lot of times uh, I mean they're they're really shy too they have to they got to trust you see the one there you see it see they got to trust you trying to take it from him <laughs> trying to be a hood a hood bird but um go, they go on look. see but they are so intelligent because i look at it this way you know it's not like everybody marks on the calendar to feed the birds that surround them and it's not that people are being evil it's just People assume that birds uh, get their own food themselves, and usually they do, but uh, I've noticed a pattern with them over here in the Midwest. Um, if uh, they don't have any food and they smell some food in your grocery bag, especially bread, uh, they'll come up on you. And that's how, that's how I started feeding them, because I would have some bread and stuff, and they'd come up on me. You know, not in an aggressive way, in a way that you could tell that they were hungry. And um, I started feeding them. Like, I'm in Ferndale right now, and I'm feeding them. Whereas, like, yesterday, I was in rural Oak, Michigan, the same thing happened. They smelled uh, that I had some bread. And they came up on me the same way. It's, it's everywhere. You know, it's the same pattern with them. They'll come up on you. And um, I fed them, and before you know it, it was a gang of them. They all came on and ate the bread, so as you can see, I got it all out here for them. And uh, you got that one over there by the garbage can, he either is gonna, yep, yeah, you see, see him coming? Yep, yeah. yeah, he is. Yeah, he real smart. So this is something I do. I've, all, I've, been, I've been feeding birds on and off, I would say. Well, I did it like 25 years ago. And uh, oh, I, I was in Detroit. I, why did I buy a loaf of bread? Boy, them birds came out of nowhere. They was, I call them hood birds. They, it was about a hundred of them came out of nowhere. And it took all the damn bread. So I ain't gonna try that shit no more. <laughs> so, now this here, they, they, they try to take it from each other if they can. But most of the time, they're pretty, uh, they're pretty nice to each other. So, uh, as you can see, it's from right here. Ain't camera shy. I like to be on the camera. All right, it's your 15 minutes of fame, uh, Big Bird, Little Brother, or whoever you are. Yeah. So this is something I enjoy doing. You know, I'll take a break away from uh, uh, the routine of life. It's in a while. Uh, I've always been in the nature in general. I, I like animals, period. I like learning about them as much as I can and as you can see this bird trusts me because they don't allow you to be this close to them if they don't trust you and that says a lot so enjoy.
enjoy the footage. I will be doing a lot of other uh, coverages on a variety of subjects. In the meantime, I'm just uh, enjoying a Sunday afternoon. It's nice out. Pretty women is everywhere. That always makes a, a day extra nice. <laughs> so, uh, tune in for the next time. Don't you go anywhere.